Bro, what is going on everybody? Spooky King 31 here. Thank you so much for joining me in this week's video. I'm sitting in my car. It is raining outside, but I'm about to go in the Goodwill. Fingers crossed that I come home with some PS2 games, some horror movies, maybe even some GameCube games. All right, everybody, stick around, see what I come home with. And if this is your first time here on the channel, hit that subscribe button. Do me a favor. All right, everybody, let's go. All right, all right, all right. So no horror or GameCube stuff, but we found Space Jam on DVD and a ton of PS2 games and two PS3 games. Stick around, we'll go over everything when we get to the house. I'm gonna go get some lunch. I don't know if I'm gonna go to McDonald's or if I'm gonna go to Taco Bell. Decisions, decisions, let's go. Looks like everybody wanted McDonald's. Right, so we are back, back from the Goodwill, and man, surprising, it was uh, pretty good, pretty decent today. I uh, got, came home with a DVD, two PS3 games, and like four, I think, PS2 games. Uh, we're gonna start off with the DVD. First up, we have Space Jam. Uh, I only have this on VHS, so it's nice to have this on DVD. Great, great movie. If you have not watched this, please check it out. And it is just loose in there, just rumbling around. And we got a double disc thing going on here. I don't know if, like, <clears throat> I saw this in there when I checked it out. I didn't know, like, if it was, what, like a soundtrack or... That's the movie. And... This is a soundtrack. There we go. Sweet deal. That's pretty awesome. All right. Uh... You know what? We're going to do the... One thing just fell out of the bag here. We're going to do the PS3 games first. Because you know me on this channel. I love PS2. So we're saving that for last. Uh, so, uh, funny story. 
Uh, I saw these games, well, this one, I don't know, I don't remember seeing this other one, but I do for sure remember seeing this one in there, and uh, they had it marked at five, uh, five ninety nine, six dollars for this, and I was like, no, 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 I took a picture and sent it to a couple uh, friends of mine in the Discord that I, I belong to, and uh, I was like, man, Goodwill's going crazy or something like that, and uh, came in there today, and they had it at just a, just a, just a colored sticker, so it was just regular price, three ninety nine. I was like, okay, okay, you know what? We'll do it because I'm curious about this series. I've never tried it, and uh, that is Borderlands. Boom. So you know, I'm pretty excited for that. Um, let me know down below in the comments if you're a fan of Borderlands, if this is worth playing or not. Um, I've never, I've I've never played it, never checked it out. Um, but it does look kind of cool. It's kind of like, it has a unique kind of st like style, like gameplay and animation and stuff. It looks pretty cool. Um, but yeah, uh, next up, we got Diablo 3. Uh, not a fan of this, not a fan of this. So uh, this is going up for trade or taking it to a game store to get store credit. Um, I just got it because, I mean, $3.99, why not, you know? Uh, but okay, so best for last here, everybody. Best for last, excuse me one second, I gotta pick up something here. Um, all right, so, four PS2 games, all right, so, up first, we have, it's not complete, it is in a rental case, but it is pretty cool because it is in a Hollywood video case. Whoa, growing up, I never went to a Hollywood video, it was always blockbuster for me, I, I, I did see Hollywood videos, but where I lived, particularly, there was only blockbusters around, so it was kind of cool to have that. Um, but I'm gonna put it with my stack of incomplete PS2 games to try to get, you know, you know, uh, get them complete one of these days. Every now and then I'll go on eBay and try to get one or two, you know. Um, before recording this funny story, uh, I was trying to look on my shelf behind me here to see if I had this or not, and see if this was gonna go in the box of trade or, for, uh, or, or to a video game store. But, um, it's Prince, Prince of Persia. And it is the sands of time. I could have sworn I had this. But, uh, went through this shelf, like, five times, and I did not see it. Maybe the six times the charm? I'm not sure. But, uh, so yeah, we're gonna put it on the shelf. It is in great, great condition. I mean, just look at that shine. I mean, come on. Like, that's, I mean, amazing. Like, these next, this and the next two are in the same condition. They're just really good. They must have came from the same person's collection because, man, it is complete. So, woo, beautiful and first gen PS2 case. So, goodness gracious, wonderful. Happy to add that to the collection. I am, once again, like I said, gonna go through this the sixth time and maybe I can find it because I could have sworn. I mean, man, you know, but I don't know. Okay, so these next two uh, I picked up simply because they were complete and I'm thinking about robbing them of their posters and hanging them up here. Uh, I don't know yet, I don't know yet. But, uh, we have Grand Theft Auto 3, boom, I mean, just beautiful, beautiful condition, I mean, that is just, it's minty, it is minty, it's a little wear here, but I mean, what the heck, complete, I mean, manual, and we got the poster, it looks like it's never even been taken out, like, it is just, whoa, and, you know, first gen PS2 case, so, like I said, probably gonna rob those of the posters and hang them up here in the game room, but I don't know. Last but not least, it's Vice City. Oh, I almost smacked myself in the face there. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we got Vice City. It is complete. I mean, first up, you got the you got the poster just looking at you, and you got the manual behind there, and I just threw the poster on the ground. But hey, it's okay because I'm gonna hang it up here in the game room. Now this, however, it looks like it's been taken out because there's some wear and tear on the corners and stuff. But hey. Uh, I'm very excited that I have this. Uh, I don't, I still am up in the air. I mean, I don't know. Should I? Should I not? Um, I don't know. Should I put these in the trade box, you know, for the group or uh, take them to the game store? I don't know. I don't know yet. I don't know. I'll have to go through because I might have Grand Theft Auto 3 already in there, but it might not be complete with the poster. I don't, I don't know. I'll have, to, I'll have to look. But yeah, everybody, that's it. That's everything that we picked up. Uh, but we are not done, not done yet with this week's video. What is going to happen next, you're wondering? Well, we're going to play something. We are going to play something. What are we going to play? Well, we're going to check out Borderlands because, I mean, why the heck not? Let's go. 
Okay. She is in stolen. All right, we'll come back when she's ready. All right. She's a working. Let's see. Okay. This is my first time ever playing a Borderlands game. So, yeah, I'll let you guys know. It's not going to be a whole lot of gameplay. Sorry that we're going old school with the capture of this. Uh, I try to use my, uh, like, my capture card, right? But uh, I was having some difficult, like, uh, I don't know, just, like, some problems, I guess, with uh, trying to capture PS3 footage. I don't know. I don't know if it was my capture card that's just weird with PlayStation 3s or... But you're saying I needed some sort of, like, uh, converter cable or something to capture the gameplay. I don't know, it was weird. I, could, I had the audio, but not the actual, you know, gameplay. I don't know. Anyway, I'm rambling. Uh, we're going to play Borderlands. Here we go. First impressions. Let's go. And we will pause this real fast and set up. And we'll come back to actual some actual gameplay. Here we go. Alright, so we skip some of the intro stuff. Still in the beginning here. <clears throat> uh, first impressions? It's pretty cool. I, I, I'm, like, kind of mixed on how I feel about, like, the, like, the animation. Like, it's, you know, like, a little cartoony, but it's, it's pretty cool. I will say the gunplay, I'm not a huge fan of that. Could be a little bit better. But, hey. Who we gotta do up here? Some more bandits. Heck yeah. Alright. <clears throat> Alright, so we just finished, I guess, maybe the tutorial. Looks like now we're going to just do a little bit of free roaming. So, let's do it. See what we got. But yeah, like I said, you know, I'm still kind of mixed on, like, the animation style. Uh, it is pretty cool. Um, but the gunplay... I don't know. I'm not a huge fan of that, to be honest. What the heck was that? Whoa. Move okay. Well, let's keep on moving. But yeah, uh, overall, I think I'm gonna like this, and I think, like, the animation is gonna... kinda, you know, I'll get used to it and probably end up appreciating it for what it is. I guess I'm just... I don't know. I'm just not... I'm not used to games that are quite cartoony, you know, but, uh... And especially, like, for, like, first-person shooters, like, you know, I don't know. But what the heck? This is, you know what? This is pretty cool, actually. Just, I, I'm just gonna have to get used to the gunplay. I mean, going from like Modern Warfare 2 to to Borderlands for the PS3, it's quite a quite a difference. I've been playing that a lot lately. But yeah, overall, guys, uh, I'm I'm digging it. I'm digging it. But yeah, I need to I need to stop talking and find some ammo here. But uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I truly do appreciate it. If you, if you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button to help me out. And I'll see you guys next week, next Saturday, 7:30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time here on the channel. Take care, stay safe. Thank you guys so much for watching. I truly do appreciate it. If you, if you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button to help me out. And I'll see you guys next week, next Saturday, 7.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time here on the channel. Take care, stay safe.